In Excel 2003, where there were toolbars, you could create custom toolbars and attach those to a specific workbook. Now, if you open a workbook that has attached toolbars in Excel 2007 or Excel 2010, you might see that toolbar appear in your add-ins tab. In this workbook, I can go to the add-ins tab and I see a snag it toolbar but that's the only thing appearing there. Now if I open one of those older workbooks that has a custom toolbar it pops up here and this one is fairly small but some of those custom toolbars can be quite large and they just fill up your whole add-ins tab. Even when I close that workbook that toolbar and its tools remain in the add-ins tab. And to get rid of that, I can just point to one of the tools that are on that toolbar, right click and click delete custom toolbar. And you'll see a, a warning message. Do I want to delete it? Yes, I do. So it's gone. It's still attached to that other workbook though. So if you open it again, you'll see it. But that's how you can get rid of it while you are in other workbooks and don't need to see that.